Hey guys, so I'm making this video to let you guys know what's going on with me and how things have been going recently, and to let you guys know why I haven't actually managed to upload in a very long time, because I believe it's been like eight months or so since I actually uploaded a video last, um, but I felt like I should explain why that is. And it's mostly because I started working and like actually got a job and got off my ass, so yeah, and I've been really busy, especially because I got a second job recently, and hopefully I'm quitting my first job, but that's a whole different thing, and uh, honestly, I might make a story time about that, because uh, I am very irritated with the company that I'm working for, um, but I will try to keep that as, like, you know, non namey as possible. I don't know how to- actually, I'm going to probably say their name, because y'all know it by- anyway. But anyway, this is not about that. This is more about, like, what I'm also planning to do. So, what I'm planning to do is make a video series about how I am planning to legitimize my business and to, like, get all the- through all the necessary paperwork to do business and, like, set up some websites- uh, some. <laughs> a website, probably, and, like, you know, show you guys how I do my commissions and how, like, I come up with my TOS and how I do all that fun stuff because I feel like it's something that most artists don't touch on and- the only time I ever actually heard about the legitimizing the business thing was through Twist Disaster when she made a video and she mentioned it, like, briefly. And I hadn't really thought about it before, although I have, like, realized that I probably need some sort of permit or something, knowing the government, to, like, do business. No matter what that business is, if you're making money, you gotta have some sort of, um, paperwork done for the government, unless you're no- you know, unless you're making less than a certain amount, and hopefully I'll be able to make more than that amount. Um, and I have made more than that amount, but we- I'm gonna work on le legitimizing my business first before paying taxes, because I feel like that's probably more important, so that I don't get in trouble for having a business that's illegal, even though it's not really that big of an issue, and I don't think the government really gives too much of a shit about it, so, like, most- the government doesn't really have the time to go after somebody who's making less than, like, I don't know, a thousand dollars through their art, um, Probably even less than that, honestly. Probably less than 500 at this point in time, but it's still something to be concerned about. And moving forward, if I want to make this my job and my career, then I'll have to have some sort of, like, legitimate business plan and have some way to be legal so that I can make more money off of this and not have to worry so much about, you know, getting taken down by the government. Not that that's probably going to happen because that's a bit of a hyperbo hyperbolic thing. But yeah, so... That's what I'm planning on doing, and I also have a couple other projects that I'm thinking about doing that are not related to videos, because this is going to be a video series, um, which is going to probably span the next month or so, possibly even longer than that, depending on how much free time I have and how busy I am, because, you know, life and working and all that stuff gets in the way pretty frequently. So I'm thinking about doing that. And then I also have the, uh, well, not thinking, I'm actually planning on doing that. But then I also have the, um, I have, a uh, the other projects that I am looking into doing, including getting, including making my own OOK, OOAK doll, uh, based off of the Reaper Leviathan from Subnautica, except, you know, in cute girl doll format. So, um, it's gonna be an interesting thing, and I, that'll take me some time because I need to build up the supplies for that, and I need to, learn how to do it, learn how to use epoxy sculpt, learn how to do all this and that. It's gonna be a learning process, but I feel like it's probably gonna be worth it because I really have wanted to possibly get into this for a while. And after I found some, like, doll lots on eBay, I decided that I should go ahead and buy those and see what I can do with them and hopefully come up with something that I'm happy with by the end of it all. Um, yeah, so that's what I'm up to. Anyway, I'm gonna let you guys enjoy the rest of this video. I think there's about a minute left at this point in time. Uh, so make sure to like and subscribe if you want to see the series of videos that I'm going to be putting out shortly. And, uh, go ahead and like and do all the things that I just told you to do. And, uh, I'll see you in the next one. Bye!